I'm Amanda Johnson, and with me is Coach Brooks after the Wildcat victory over Menlo. Thank you for talking with me, and congratulations on your first win. Um, tell me a little bit about the game and just your thoughts overall. Well, I was really pleased with how hard our kids competed. I thought they came out. Uh, it's a first game, and there's a lot of nerves. You got four seniors who've invested a lot, and so you never know how that's going to happen. I, my biggest concern was that they would want it too much and that maybe we would play tight. And, I, and there were times when I felt like that a little bit, but for the most part, we, uh, we competed hard and, and definitely on the defensive end, we made uh, some plays at the right time and we were able to go on a run and get away from them. And, and that's something that you know we needed to be able to do. I think it was an 18-2 run that we went on and uh, it gave us a chance to have the game that we had. So talk a little bit about the first half. I mean, you had a tie, 11 to 11, and then from there completely took the game, I mean, took control of it. So what was the difference? Well, I think our defense, we got stops. Um, uh, I think that's where we went on an 18 to two run. I think they scored two points, we scored 18 points, and we got away from them. Um, and I think we ran, I think we scored like nine baskets in a row or something, somebody said, I don't know if that's accurate. but. Um, you know, when you do that, you give yourself a chance to get away. And, uh, they're a team that's been hot. Uh, they won eight of their nine games coming into this tournament and won their conference championship. And uh, I was nervous about how we would handle their physical play. Um, they're really physical on the ball, and they really do a nice job on offensive glass. And that was an area that we really emphasized. And we only gave them eight offensive rebounds. And, um, you know, that was important as well. I mean, they definitely came out ready to play you guys. And I know you talked a little bit with the girls about having a target on their back, their number one rank. So how do you feel having this first win under your belt and now moving forward in the tournament? Well, I think you get that first one, you're always relieved because there's so much. You know, the new kids are trying to figure this out and trying to get a handle on all of it. The older kids, you know, are kind of tense because they know if they lose, they're done. Um, and so I think there's relief. Uh, to get the first one out of the way, and, and now we got to go to work because we have Friends University on Friday at 10:15, and um, we watch some of their game. Uh, the assistant coaches watched the majority of it, but I was getting ready for ours. Uh, but I'll go back and get on videotape and watch, and it's going to be really, uh, you know, we're going to have our hands full because they're a good team that can really shoot it, and uh, you know we have to come out and play defense and. Uh, hopefully do a better job offensively finishing plays. You know, we struggled in the second half to finish plays, and we struggled from the free throw line. And that's an area that's really frustrating to me because we're a better shooting team than what we show at the free throw line the last couple games. And to me, it's a mental thing. You know, it's, you know, we've got to, we've got to be mentally tougher when we go to the free throw line. So. Sounds good and great time for them to kind of, you know, get away from the basketball and hopefully refresh right. their bodies and minds. Right. But thank you very much and congratulations on your win today. I'm Amanda Johnson for Wildcat Central.